Alice and Davis. We're together. Your name is James Benjamin Tucker. Your father's name's Henry, your mother's name's Catherine. And we've been out here for four days. Uh, what are you talking about? Uh, how do you know this? The same about... six questions that you ask me every morning. Things tend to switch up a little bit after that. It's just supposed to be a fun hike, you know? Baxter Woods, but once the sun went down, started raining, fell down a slope. When we hit the ground, you weren't moving. You came to after a few minutes, though. Neither of us were all that hurt. We decided to keep trying to find a way back up. But come morning, it was pretty clear how lost we were. Uh, I dreamt that I was in my normal life. You do every night. I think it's because of the head trauma. I dream it. It felt real. I know. But I promise you, this is reality. I can't lose you again. I don't know what I would do. Should be enough for tonight. Excellent job, Miss Davis. Why, thank you, Mr. Tucker. <laughs> you know, being out here sucks. It does, but it has its moments. So this girl, you only see her in your dreams? Yeah, every night. Well, aren't reoccurring dreams kind of normal? I mean, yeah, I guess they are, but these are convincing. Well, have you tried talking to someone professional about it? I'm talking to you. Okay, no, I mean like a shrink or a psychiatrist. I don't know. Maybe. Allison! Allison! You remember who I am? 
Yeah. I do. It's day five, right? Uh. Oh. Come on. We should get going. Going where? James. Who's out there? Where am I? I know you must feel as though you're losing your mind, and with good reason. But do try to keep your patience, James. You. You're the one I keep seeing. Who are you? I'm less of a who and more of a what. Some people call me the Boatman. Others, Davy Jones. But most, the Grim Reaper. You, you're death. Look, we don't have a lot of time here, kids, so let's move on. Here we are. James Benjamin Tucker. You're currently equidistant. Am I dead? No. But you will be soon. That is, if you don't choose the correct path. You either wake up in bed, or you wake up in the woods. Yeah, well, which one is real? Well, technically both. Think of it this way. You're hopping between two parallel roads. One leads back to where you want to go, true reality. The other leads deeper into hopeless endlessness. Why can't you just tell me which one is which? <laughs> I want to wake up, like really wake up. You mortals are so alike. Because it doesn't work that way, okay, Jimmy boy? I mean, look, I'd love to help you, but I can't. But why not? Because it ain't my job, kid. Look, we're running out of time here. Tomorrow, you're gonna come to a crossroads. Be careful and mindful where you step. Got it? Okay. So what now? Sweet dreams, James. 
wrong? Uh, uh, nothing, just another nightmare. Hey, it's okay. Hey, you woke up knowing who I am two days in a row. <laughs> I call that a breakthrough. Come on, let's get going. You've got a good feeling about today. <laughs> Come on, James. What's wrong? Cross the bridge. I can't. Can't? What do you mean, can't? Come on, let's go. I'm sorry, Allison. I am. I'm just tired of waking up in the woods. What are you talking about? Stop acting so weird. Where are you going? James! Come back! You can't just leave me like this! James! 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 James? I keep on forgetting you It's not accident or it's something that I Get in. 